Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about Biden's pardons, what we can uh, kind of guess is going to happen next, and what student debt can teach us about them. I wasn't actually going to do a video on this yet, and you'll find out why here in a little bit. Um, but a whole bunch of questions have come in, so we're just going to kind of run through some of the questions and talk about what this does and what it doesn't do. Okay, so if you missed the, the big news here, the Biden administration issued a blanket pardon for those who uh, were convicted of simple possession of cannabis at the federal level. And that's the first question. Why only the federal level? Because that's all the power he has. He can't do anything at the state level. He has no authority over that. That's up to governors. He did, in his executive orders, um, kind of encourage them to do so, but he can't make them pardon. Uh, there are some people saying they're not really a pardon because nobody's getting out. No, thousands of people are being pardoned. Um, and that is thousands of people at the federal level. And my understanding is that this includes D.C. as well. And there's going to be a whole bunch more there. I would imagine, I would think that there might even be more there. But that's gut feeling. I don't have numbers on that. Um, so you're, you're talking about thousands of people who are being pardoned, but nobody's being let out. The reason nobody's being let out is because there's nobody in there. Why? That eternal question. Why? Aren't people currently in custody for this? Because the shift already started. They've stopped, they've stopped prosecuting this. That's step one. Pardoning those for simple possession, well, that's step two. The next step would be descheduling it, taking it off of the list of substances you can't have. Biden can't order it descheduled directly. Um, but he can order a review of it. And hypothetically speaking, if he was to order that review at the same time he pardoned a bunch of people, that would send a pretty strong signal. Um, and that's exactly what he did. The, the descheduling, that's, I don't want to say it's in the works because he can't order that. Um, but he can order the review. The review that would lead to descheduling has been ordered. Um, so that is step three. I'm fairly certain there's more to come. And this is why. Everybody knows about Biden's big student debt thing. Ten or twenty thousand dollars forgiven, right? Go to Google and type in Biden forgives student debt. But then go to the tools. You have to do this on the desktop site. Go to tools and go down to where it says anytime, click on that and change it to custom range and set the end date for August 1st. You're going to find out that prior to that big announcement, he forgave billions of dollars in student debt. It just didn't make huge headlines. I have a feeling this is the same process. He, for whatever reason, this administration does a lot of stuff piecemeal. Now, my guess, and this is just a guess, is that they're working out the bugs before they do bigger stuff. Um, and that may be the case here. There are other questions about the pardoning is, you know, it, there's still a legal paperwork trail. Well, yeah, I mean, that's, that's how pardons work. Um, there is still a paperwork trail, but let me just ask you this. If you're walking into a job interview, would you rather say, yes, I have this charge and I was pardoned or yes, I have this charge? There, there's a, 
there, there's a little bit of a difference there in how a prospective employer might look at it. People may actually still end up being barred from certain things, though. It's not a clean slate. Um, but it's a step. And that's how I perceive this, to the point where I really wasn't going to do a video about it. Because I don't think... I don't think that this story is done yet. I think there's a lot more that's going to be coming, but we have to wait and see. But that catches you up to now. Just understand you're going to see this material again. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.